rolling? We're rolling. You ready? <laughs> It's raining out, and today we're starting vocals. Hey now, hey. give them a sing. Jesse, give them a, give them a sneak peek. La la la. There you go. Expect a lot more of that. Hey. I guess I first started singing in my bedroom to like all the pop hits of the early to mid 2000s. All right, it's 10:15 p.m. on Friday night. Jesse, are you ready to record some vocals? So ready. Billy, how you feeling? You know, wearing a hood is very good for listening to uh, transients and the music. Actually, it uh, helps. Oh, nice. Aren't real. <laughs> when we first started the band, I knew in theory that Jessie could sing. I had heard how she had been in plays for years and that uh, she was a singer. But I didn't really, we hadn't played together before and it wasn't something that was planned. We first started, I guess it was Jason, Joe, and me. It must have been when we lived all together in Farmingdale, right? Mm -hmm. Back in the garage. We were playing some songs I had written, a couple of covers, trying to just feel out, you know, when you're starting a band, that's how you do it. And one day Jesse came in and said, Hey, I can, I can do a cover. And then we added on Jesse and she would sit on the washing machine. Next thing you know, Jessie's singing on more and more songs. She's singing backing vocals on some, she's starting to do some leads, and as time went on with the band, that only grew. It became harder and harder for me to write a song and not want Jessie to sing it. And she was great, and I didn't know that she was, because she was just dating Jason, And but apparently you can both date Jason and sing really well, and uh, that was great to have a different dynamic. Okay. <laughs> I think we got it. <laughs> she has the power of two people singing at once. Poor baby's like, what is going on? All right. <laughs> <laughs> Take a hand now. <laughs> That's preg pregnant punk. <laughs> yeah, folks with double horns. Do most of your bands, so they filled with pregnant women. Uh, that's how I prefer them. Um, <laughs> this is the first time I'm, I'm lucky enough to succeed in that goal. It's been fine. I was a little worried about how vocals would be, because he's putting so much pressure on my diaphragm at all times. But I think everything's coming out sounding good. So, yeah. Pregnant in a band. Rock and roll, baby. I think it's a real, uh, it's a real crowd pleaser, um, you know really gets people's attention. That's what you need. I've always said that. I also give her credit for going into her recording a studio a month before she gives birth, so that's pretty incredible. <laughs> Hold on. Let's get it a little bit tighter. <laughs> Even my bloopers are good, guys. Even my bloopers. <laughs> 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 Perfectly in tune. <laughs> so the second part of the second verse goes into that like, and I'm like, ah, the yeah. whole time. As soon as Jesse's voice gets in the songs, they pop. As soon as Jesse adds back and vocals to parts I've sang, it's wow, so much better right away. And yeah, Jesse's like. Jesse made the band what it is, you know. I think people know us, they know we're the band with the, you know, the two of us singing and Jesse's it. Jesse. Jesse's my favorite, you know. Great voice, great contributor to the whole musical experience, mother to be. You know, nothing nothing to not love there. Um, she's not here today, but counting on you, Jessica. I try and go. You keep find me, find me. Won't let me go. 
Okay. Mm, mm, mm. Can I? Mm. No, I got it. I got it. I got it. Yeah. Can I have it with that in it? Fuck you. Sorry. <laughs> you missed your intro. I know. Sorry. I was listening to the beat. I liked it. Have there. I'm gonna get there. Sorry. Do it again. <laughs> Sorry, guys. This is it. Okay. Did you like sprinkles on ice cream? Yeah. yeah. No. My first performances were based in living rooms <laughs> all around, um, mostly family living rooms. So the second there was a camera out, like that's when my, my performances started. Jesse is a fantastic singer. Jesse's a fantastic performer. And when I'm put next to her on stage, it forces me to up my game. I need to be a better singer to uh, keep up, you know, so I don't look, it doesn't sound ridiculous when I'm singing a song versus when Jesse's singing a song. So I've truly worked in my craft to keep up with Jesse. So uh, thanks to Jesse being in the band, I'm better. I like how Jesse is on stage. Like you can catch me a few times during her shows, like watching Jesse sing, cause she does it like so effortlessly. And um, effortless, effortless. Anytime I could get anyone to like pay attention to me by singing loudly or dancing, that was that was where you could find me from the ages of like when I could start walking till now. <laughs> <laughs> Like a shadow you can't shake Slithering out like a snake A virus that makes my heart ache I need a break, hit the brakes way too late When I see you walking well I just walk out and I know Move far too slow, I try and go I need water Ugh. That was very nice, Jesse. Thanks. The first big role I had in play was my freshman year. I played um, Bianca in Kiss Me Kate. That show in the couple months that we did it, it like changed how I was as a performer and I learned so much. Um, so yeah, that was my first like big role. We got some footage of that, check it. If I wasn't worth it, would you ask me to grow up again? What you say is not the same as you do, it's the same in the end. You think you know me? No, you don't know me. My favorite song on the record is You Think You Know Me. Um, I think it's just like all coming together really nicely and everyone gets like a little bit to like showcase themselves. So, yeah, I think you think you know me. That's my favorite. <laughs> <laughs> Playing in context again. I may be biased as, you know, Jessie's my wife, but you know, she's my favorite person in the band. You look great. Really? Yeah. Who says that? We're all liars. That's all I got about Jessie. Goodbye. Bye. Bye.